So today we have a photo shoot with Inside Cheerleader magazine and we're supposed to be on the cover and it's really exciting. Um, it's like stage and it goes Oh, okay. Perfect. 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 This is the first time we're all getting kind of dolled up and a lot of us have never worn the Cali name on our chest and so it's pretty cool for a lot of us. So, I barely put on makeup for practice. I don't wear any. She yeah. probably brushed her hair today. I did. That's a good day. That never that usually never happens. happens. And it doesn't smell like salt today. I'm really proud of you. <laughs> Inside Cheerleader Magazine is a magazine that carries like a lot of different teams. It represents like a lot of different programs and people in the cheer industry. And it's a big thing that a lot of cheerleaders look at. Ooh, I look good. I look like Mona Lisa! They're featuring boys from different programs, so they're going to be doing a special shoot for me, Matthew, Freddie, and Enrique, just getting our backgrounds and just getting to know us for the magazine. The fact that we're going to be able to be on one of the biggest cheerleading magazines is cool because everyone wants to know what we've been doing this year. I know that in past years, mod has been in the magazine. They've had this opportunity before. We have so many new kids on the team. It's a good way to get us put in the industry and get ourselves out there. We are at J Tory Studio. We're really excited. The kids are all dressed up. We're going to be going out to a Riverbed and doing like an edgy like shoot. So I'm really excited for it. Back in 2013, me and a couple other people on the team were on the cover of IC. It was just a really good experience. We got to do a photo shoot at a competition right before we competed, and so it just like kind of got us pumped up. So this is going to be a really good experience for this team to just kind of get their first feel of like the caliber of a team that they're on. J Tory is actually one of my uh, good friends. She is the person behind Smode's amazing pictures every season, so we're excited to work with her. And uh, IC decided to use her to shoot the cover, and it's a great opportunity for everybody. All right, roll out, let's go. What if my car got towed? Boom. We are in uh, Ojai, we are out in the mountains, and we're in the wilderness, and yeah. There's poop everywhere, I don't know, I'm not trying yeah. to step on any of it. Eat it. I'll do it if Sarah can get it. Sarah can be first. No. Come on, ladies first. No. Horse poop, just a bite, you don't have to run for a whole week. A week, Two Only weeks. a week, two weeks? Two weeks. Tara. And he said it, like, if I eat it, <laughs> I know. I don't need to run tomorrow and all the week. <laughs> now, if you rub it on your teeth. I do it if Eddie do it. It's exciting for them. Things like this are fun for the kids to do. We're outside of practice. Everybody's here, right? Head count, one. I don't feel like this is 20. Jesus. Four. Six. Eight. Who do we appreciate? One. Me. It's really good for Smoed and it's a good experience and I'm looking forward to it. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yep, we're good. You guys, we're in the wilderness. I'm Mandy, and I'm the creative director at Inside Cheerleading Magazine. This issue is going to be a special double cover, so it's going to feature both the boys and the entire team. The kids seem great. They have a lot of really great energy. <laughs> oh, this one? Stay right there, guys. Yes, you are doing a very good job. Thank you, Eddie. Mm -hmm. Wade, you're fired. Eddie's hired. It's actually really fun. Um, 
It's a good bonding experience for all of us. It's really fun. We're all just talking and chilling. And it's really pretty, like the scenery with the mountains and the trees and bushes and stuff. <laughs> Ready? Look pretty. Don't fall. Don't break anything. We need those legs. One, two, three. The train is really rocky. Again, we're in a uh, dried riverbed and there's tons of boulders. The kids are wearing chair shoes that are don't have a lot of traction on them. Kind of scary to walk around. <laughs> so we're all being really careful. Like everybody is so scared to like step because like we're gonna like trip and fall. So like, everybody's like being so careful right now. And it's like really funny to watch everybody. <laughs> I'd hate for them to get hurt just walking around box, but they're having a good time, so that's all I'm at right now. Can we all step over this way, like, a few inches? The theme of the issue in general is actually the boys of All Star. There's also going to be lots of boys from other dims, from different levels, different programs from all across the country. Hey, I'm Jonah. Hey, I'm Freddie. I'm Matthew. Hey, I'm Enrique from Floyd, and I'm from Glendale, California. Being on a small co-ed team, there's only four boys. So I feel like being one of the four boys on any small co-ed team is such an amazing opportunity. Being on small it's really nice. It's like a dream coming true. Like, I want to be on this thing since, like, my single year of cheer. For Enrique, now he's going to be, like, presented as, as a part of the team because now he's on the team for real. Like, he's made the team. He's not labeled as the alternate anymore. He's one of the boys. I've been cheering for about five and eight years, and I joined because my sister was doing it, and I really wanted to learn how to do a flip. And from there, I kind of kept going on, and like I've gotten better and better every year, and especially since I joined here, I feel like I've really progressed really quick, and I wouldn't want to do anything else but cheer. This year, I tried out for Schmoed, but I didn't make it, and I was an alternate. You know, I talked to Eddie, and he told me if I keep working, there's a chance that I could make it, and it motivated me to keep working. I'm really proud of him and I think he's one of like the best working athletes on the team right now. I really want to be on this team because you know they're one of the best teams in the country and the fact that I have an opportunity to be on it just amazes me. Smile, smile. Boys nice and tall. Think tall thoughts. It's like the first time that our team actually feels like a unit like we're all together, we're all wearing the same thing. It's a really good time, it's like bonding for all of us. One, two, three, smile. Ready, one, two, three, smile. I feel like this magazine is really gonna give people an opportunity to know what we've been doing and how we've been progressing and how we can live up to the name that they built. We just got done with our photo shoot with Inside Cheerleading Magazine. Thank you Inside Cheerleading for uh, allowing us this great opportunity. We had so much fun, the kids had fun. Uh, it was a beautiful day today in Ojai. And JTOR did an amazing job, so that's a wrap. Hey guys, it's Jonah. Thanks for watching Cheerleaders, and don't forget to subscribe to Awesomeness TV.